Our apprentices come in and they're already artists. They're already fabulous artists. They, they want to paint, they want to draw, they want to make things. But to get their, um, you know, sort of wrap their heads around the business side of arts. I think a program like Arts on the Block is good for the community because uh, public art really is beneficial for everyone. You know, not just, not only the person who's commissioning it, but everyone who interacts with it. So just taking young artists who's passionate about arts and just getting them to think about the business side of things and to you know, really understand that it's not just about making the art, it's about making the art but it's also figuring out where to get your materials from, how much does it cost, how much time could and should I spend on a product and then marketing and then everything that goes into the planning of the market, everything from making the product to pricing to marketing to wrapping it up, to putting all the, the marketing information with it, loading it in the car and getting it to the market. I'm just expanding my art skills because it's not only about painting and drawing, there's also mosaics involved and that's why I joined this program. I made a fender and a few cards. Um, my, my lamp that I made myself was so bad. I was proud of that. We just bought two raffle tickets um, for the chance to win one of the mirrors and or the lamp. They're all very nice. I think it's absolutely amazing to see the detail and that it, you know, this is them now and imagine as they progress. And uh, it's, it's, the stuff's pretty reasonably priced, so I mean, you get a really nice product, you know, that you can put in your house that's original. Um, I'm a huge fan of um, um, drawing, and um, I even make up my own characters and stuff like that. Um, also, I really like to do the mosaics, and like to learn other ways of making art. Um, I... When I come up with inspiration, it's usually something personal, like what I like, like animals, patterns and stuff. For me as the lead artist to watch them grow and develop in confidence, um, I think that's one of my most, val my personal most valuable experiences in this program, to watch someone who comes in and who's not necessarily entirely confident in talking to people, strangers, and at the market telling me I'm, you know, I'm not good at small talk. But then a little later I watch them actually talk to a client and interact and get excited about their program and then coming back to me and telling me I just spoke to a stranger and it wasn't that bad. I think each of them um, have grown and each of them have developed and each of them have changed and hopefully all of them walk away with having learned something, improved something.